using your capacity to make the Transkaya annual destination to visit. It is really worth your while. Fishing tales and magnificent stories. Spending time here and waking up early mornings. Everywhere you look, it's as if every shadow, every corner, every plant and every rock has thousands of fishing tales and great adventurous stories. When you visit the Transkaya, it sucks deep into your heart and lays a foundation that will always be there. For any angler, this is South Africa's paradise. And Mazeppa Bay is no different. And over years, Mazeppa Bay Hotel makes the stay for any angler or visitor even more special. With their great hospitality, great food, great setting and really comfortable accommodation, where else would you go? Good morning guys. We're on the island here at Mazeppa Bay. We spent the night at Mazeppa Bay Hotel after having a wonderful dinner last night. We wake, we've woken up to the stunning, stunning sunrise and a really, really big sea. I slept in a little bit. I was a bit sore after yesterday's fish. So yeah, we're gonna give it a bash today. The sea's big. We've got one line out so far. We'll get the rest of the lines out now. But yeah, otherwise it's looking promising for a bite. Uh, hopefully we'll check you guys in a bit to the really big fish in the end. The fishing year speaks for itself and the diversity of spots and species it. adds to the whole array of worthwhile experiences. Is it the way? Big fish. So chuffed. In big seas? Oh Drone fishing is fast becoming a very popular method and the anglers have caught on to use the right tackle which is probably the most important part of practicing drone fishing. Make sure you have the right tackle and the right end tackle not to lose fish. Also from a courtesy point of view I want to put it out there to all drone anglers. There's a space for every facet of angling. Drones allow you to fish a lot more spots than what regular rock and surf anglers can. Therefore consider rock and surf anglers where they gather in certain areas. These areas are more prone for rock and surf fishing. Just move a little bit to the right or to the left, north or south and practice your responsible drone fishing in that area. That way we consider everybody and there's space for every sub facet of fishing. And it goes without saying, if you arrive at a rock and surf spot where the fish are coming out on cast baits, get stuck in with cast baits. No need to fly the drone there. Drones open up your opportunity to fish almost anywhere, especially when the conditions are too hard to cast. Several casting spots allow for great drone fishing as well and can accommodate both casting and drone anglers at the same time. Mazeppa is a good example of that. Jeremy and Tyron on their last trip practice every sub facet. They used the kite on days that called for it. They used the drone on the tough days where casting was difficult to get a bite and they cast it when the conditions allowed for casting to deliver the results. I can say with confidence that there's space in every shore based angler's equipment for a drone. Not everybody can fish every day and when you have time to fish and the conditions aren't favorable for casting the drone allows you to still get a bait out there. I think she's coming to have a look and make some great experiences. Guys, we hooked up onto another really good shark here. Marlban's hooked up using the Saltiga Lever Drag 60, 65 pound J braids holding up like a dream. So, yeah, she's turned, she's slowly moving in. Let's try to get her out. Uh, we're going to give it our all, and yeah, we will get her out. So, yeah, I'm so ready. Something really big here, man. Oh. Now the Dawa dog fight has quickly earned its stripes in drone fishing, making it the reel of choice with general drone fishing, being able to target any species, and we've seen fish now close to 400 kilos landed on it. Fighting the wind again. We are about to uh, drop another bait, a second bait. Now the Dawa dog fight. The capacity on this reel allows for 65 pound to 80 pound backing and top shot of almost a thousand meters with another hundred meters monofilament top shot. This is more than adequate and this matched up with the saltest extra heavy rod makes a great combination. Guys, what, two hours 40 minutes? Um, yeah, and she's taking me back down again. So yeah, let's see what happens. We should, we should get her out. Um, very, very big fish. So with her size and everything we should yeah, we should win this one. We'll see how it 
One of the benefits fishing two, three hundred meters out is that you can allow the fish to get tired when it's still far out. Your biggest challenge in landing these big fish are close in shore when they get closer to the reefs or any of the obstacles they can cut you off on. Of course out there there's also a couple of reefs but that's out of your control. Thus take your time with the fish far out until it starts coming easier. This fish definitely gave Jeremy a run for his money and an absolute great test for the Daiwa Dogfight LD60. When you go on these trips, they're costly, they cost you a lot of money and you only have a certain amount of time to get some results and get some good photos. Combining casting, droning and cut gives you options in every possible weather conditions. Die-hard anglers, only a hurricane can then keep them off the rocks. The last part of the fight when you get it close in is the most crucial. Reserve as much of your energy for this time of the fight. After three hours, you don't want to run out of energy and lose a really good fish. This is our last swing, yeah? I'm waiting for the fish. That's a massive fish. And the most unexpected result. Enormous black skate at Mazeppa comes to show again that you never know what to expect when fishing Mazeppa Bay. The black skates are known to be prolific from the Southern Cape around to the Western Cape where you would go to target them. And these massive flying saucers is way up there when it comes to a noteworthy fight. Only a handful of anglers in South Africa has landed the really big ones. These fish absolutely use their weight advantage, currents and sucking onto the bottom to make it one of your toughest fights you'll ever have. Braid has allowed us to pull these fish a bit harder and we've seen more of them being landed over the last couple of years. In my opinion, one of the most beautiful skates there are. They've got this really mean look on their face, typical to one of these big WWF wrestlers, but a soft heart, if you had to ask me. Right guys, this is a culprit, a good sort of black ray. So chuffed, it's a new species, a species you've never caught, eh? Hey? No, it was, it was insane, it just boxed the whole way. Yeah. Um, yeah, and the tackle as usual did the business, so uh, yeah, absolutely stoked. Massive fish and they fight, it's good. Quite hard, they fight, it's insane fish, yeah. I really enjoyed it. Insane, insane. This trip has been a session of a lifetime, I must say. Yeah, this is just another one to add to the list. So chuffed. Eh? Yeah, incredible looking creatures, let's get her back. Cool guys. Well done to Jeremy on a great catch. And of course, having Andrew Swellendalbo around makes the job easy. In fetching the fish, knowing where to go, knowing what to do, getting all the right advice, and safely releasing fish. And to all anglers that don't know, stay very clear from those vicious spikes on the back. Not something you want to encounter on any trip. And that makes what we do so amazing. It's the release. Getting the photo, getting the experience, seeing these beautiful areas and beautiful specimens. Getting to understand how they fight, where they feed and everything related in getting results. We are blessed as anglers for everything we get to experience and see. Let us show the same respect wherever we go to keep our spots clean, respect the environment and respect the fish. We thank you and salute you again. Transkai and Mazeppa Bay. Thank you to all for watching and following ASFN. We are proud to be part of this fishing family, the ASFN family, and giving you all the information we possibly can so that you too can get better results.